All right, so um, this is January 2020. Um, question number six, it says the radius of each circle um, in the rectangle WXYZ shown below is seven centimeters. The circle fits exactly into the, sorry, the circles fit exactly into the rectangle. Um, by saying that what the examiner is saying that there is essentially no space between the um, circles. They are saying that they are, essentially what they are saying is that there is no space. So regardless of how it looks, that is not important. The examiner is telling you that there is no space between the rectangles. Then he says, show that the area of the rectangle is 2,352 centimeters square. Essentially what you have to remember, notice is that um, the diameter of the circle is 14 centimeters. Now, um, the length is therefore um, four, four by 14, and the width is three by 14. Four by 14 is 56 centimeters and three by 14 is 42 centimeters. So the length of the rectangle is 56 centimeters and the width is 42. Now the area would be length multiplied by width, which is 56 times 42, and that would be equal to 2,352 centimeters squared. All right, so the first part of the question is finished. Let's move on. Next, we're asked to calculate the area of the shaded region. Well, to get the area of the shaded region, we have to first find the area of the 12 circles. Um, the circles are exactly the same. So all we need to do is to find the area of one and then multiply it by 12. So area of circles would be equal to 12 multiplied by pi r squared, which is 22 over seven times seven over one times seven over one. So this is 12 times 154. So 12 times 154. And this is 1848. So the area of the 12 circles combined is 1848 centimeters squared. Now the area of the shaded region. would be equal to um, 2,352, I think. Let's just double, double check. Yes, minus 1,848. The area of the shaded region is 500, and four centimeters squared. The area of the shaded region is 504 centimeters squared. Continuing. All right, next page. This says the diagram below not drawn to scale shows triangle um, MNP in a, sorry, um, in which angle M P N is equal to angle P M N is equal to 52 degrees. And the length of M N is 12.5 centimeters. First of all, we're asked to state the type of triangle shown below, shown above. Well, that's not difficult. This is an isosceles triangle. This is an isosceles triangle. How do I know that? Um, 
these two angles are equal. They are called base angles. And because the reason, it could either be isosceles or equilateral. But in order for it to be equilateral, those two angles would have to be 60. So since they're not 60, it is an isosceles triangle. All right, if it's an isosceles triangle, this would be the base. This would be the apex. And these two sides would be equal. The two equal sides always go to the apex. So if this is 12.5, this is also 12.5 centimeters. Next, we're asked to determine the value of angle um, N, P, M, sorry, P, N, M. So that is angle N. Whenever three angles, sorry, whenever three lines, whenever three um, letters are used to represent an angle, the angle is always at the letter in the middle. So it says determine the value of, um, so P, angle P, N, M, would be equal to 180 minus 52 plus 52. So if you have three angles that add up to 180 degrees and you know the size of two, to find the size of the final one, you just simply add up those two and take it away from 180. So this is 180 minus 104. The answer here is 76 degrees. So the angle here is 76 degrees. All right, and finally, we're asked to calculate the area of triangle MNP. Now the area, this is a non right angle triangle, is equal to a half AB sine C. Now this formula, to find the area of a triangle is used when you know the length. First of all, it's a non-right angle triangle. You know the length of two sides of the triangle and the inclusive angle. So here, this is um, 0 0.5, that's a half, times 12.5, times 12.5. And the sign of the angle between those two sides is 76 degrees. So lastly, you will just put this in a calculator and press equal. So this is 0 0.5 times 12.5 times 12.5, the sine of 76 degrees. The answer here is um, 75.8, and this is centimeters squared. So the area of the triangle, to three significant figure is 75.8, and that is centimeters square, and that is the end of the question.